All right, folks, we're going to go outside and we're going to take some beam shots. We are going to compare this Olight. It is the M3XS-UT Javelot. Uh, it's a newer light by Olight, and I think it's claim to fame. It's supposed to have a 100-meter throw at uh, 1,200 lumens uh, for its first five minutes, and then the lumen count drops a little bit lower. I will say that uh, I am amazed at how much throw this has and how bright it is, how concentrated the uh, the beam is. Um, I've taken it outside a few times, and when you start shining around the neighborhood, people's lights in their houses start turning on. They're like, what the hell is going on? What's out there? Um, so anyhow, and we're going to compare that with a couple of shots against the uh, Phoenix PD-35. I know that uh, the Phoenix PD-35 is not regarded as an incredible thrower or a particularly floody light, somewhere in the middle. The reason I picked this light is it's a really popular light that a lot of people have experience with, so I figured it would be a good comparison. Um, any feedback in the comments is welcome, and I apologize in advance for the quality of the video. Uh, I'm trying out a camera that I haven't used much, and uh, hopefully these shots turn out well. Thank you. All right, folks, we're out here in the dark, and we're going to compare beam shots for the Phoenix PD-35 and the uh, Olight Javelot. It is the uh, M3XS-UT. And I'm hoping I can pull this off without uh, getting the police <laughs> called on me or anything like that. Um, it is a little bit hazy out tonight, so that's probably going to impact the throw. And then off in the distance there... I would say that that's about 75 to 100 yards is a tree line. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to shoot the uh, Phoenix light first. So I don't know if you can see that up there. And then here comes the Javelot. Okay, now we're going to set up a different shot. Okay, we have some other trees that are, I'd say, probably about 100 to 125 yards, somewhere in that neighborhood. I tried some other uh, shots, but it just wasn't coming through on this camera, so I'm not really sure if it's a problem with the camera or what. But So anyhow, you can see, there it is, with the Phoenix. And then there is your beam shot with the Javelot. Here are some up close at about 20 yards. Okay, there's a ridge of trees that's quite far away. And uh, I'm not sure if we're going to be able to see this or not. I can't even estimate it. I would probably put it at about 500 yards. I'm not sure if that's going to come across or not.